Oh, you know what? I could probably just make it down into the lake below. All right, here we go. YOLO. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, I'm gonna try to hit the hay. Oh, God. All right, this is JY with another mind-blowing seven days to die video. It's day 280. Alpha 17.2 patches just dropped. The server is still on 17.1. We're looking to reset the server and say goodbye to this world. So here is the mighty sand castle in the sky that my friends built. You can see the tower goes all the way up to the very top of the vertical limit. The sand castle was built straight into a mountain and a mighty trench was dug all around the base. It cleaves straight into the mountainside as you can see here. Originally the zombies did not attack the mountain, they were too stupid to, but eventually the lower area had to be fortified with concrete. For the most part, I, I didn't really hang out here because I was working on building my troll farm. Plus, I overheated in the desert because I hadn't put any points into uh, the well insulated perk. But with three points in it and, uh, and a leather duster, I now no longer overheat in the desert, which is nice because before I got sweltering it. You lose a bunch of attributes, which is really lame. So this is the main entrance to the castle. Uh, we'll do a quick walk around. So there's a gigantic trench all around. The zombies cannot make the hop, and then they fall down and die. Well, actually, they don't die because they're all irradiated zombies. They have too many hit points. But then they fall down, and they climb right back up like lemmings. And eventually, they all get picked off. This is the main area that the zombies try to come in on, and then they get sliced and shot to death by the traps eventually. Alright, so this is our main area. So we called this place Phoenix, Arizona, because it's in the middle of the godforsaken desert. Uh, this is some random douchebag. This is the inside of the base. All right, so we'll do a quick tour. Here is a bedroom area with bulletproof glass. Here is a garden area. Yeah, I gotta say my troll farm garden is much better, but it's, this is okay. All right, so this is the sand castle in the sky. Uh, before we take a look at all of that, go back down and show the lower area. So this was my contribution. Uh, down here I started helping uh, dig out. I was hoping to create a nice beautiful vista uh, while still making sure the zombies couldn't jump over. So this gives uh, additional vantage points to shoot the zombies. Uh, it was very nerve-wracking digging this out because I didn't want to collapse the roof above, but it worked out. I didn't get a chance to finish everything. But the idea was to uh, dig a path um, all along the outside so there would be a vista and then build out additional floors below. Uh, someday, I guess. Yep, it's a pretty nice view. All right, so going back up, now we'll go to the top of the castle. So this is where we rain down death and destruction <coughs> from the zombies. Uh, I've got an arrow slit here, but it doesn't actually uh, do anything. So if you're feeling emo, you can just walk all the way up to the ledge and then decide whether or not you want to end it. Uh, show a couple more rooms so there's a farm here 
This is the main drawbridge. Looks like there's another bedroom in here. Nothing too exciting. Mushroom grow area. Alright, and to conclude the tour, we have the Tower of Power. And this will be a good time to experiment, because in previous versions, uh, falling down in a hay bale wouldn't kill you. So I think this will be a good way to end the video, is to see if I die when I jump, jump down. Well, we will see what happens. Here I was uh, trying to build a staircase, but uh, eventually ran out of resources and stopped bothering. <coughs> ah, but it looks like my friends extended it. Does this go all the way up? That would be pretty crazy. Oh shit, actually this goes pretty high. Oh my god, did they, did they actually build it all the way to the top? I'm not getting dizzy. This is fine. Oh shit, they did get all the way to the top. Well damn. Well done, guys. What a beautiful view. And I would guess... That would just be... A bunch of wasteland. Uh, yeah, the, our map is... Uh, pretty small um this uh, the borders here are all irradiated um uh, irradiated areas where you die pretty quickly um, so i think that's another reason we're going to reset okay actually so the problem is i don't actually know where I placed the hay. I was gonna plan on jumping off for the lulls, uh, but I actually did want to see if the hay prevents uh, falling to your death, so I did see the ladder earlier. Okay, so it's on this side, uh, facing east. Okay, so I'll go back to the top. And I'm going to try to fall down on the hay. Alright, so now I'm facing east. <coughs> Some water. Oh, you know what? I could probably just make it down into the lake below. Alright, here we go. YOLO. Gonna try to hit the hay. Oh god. Wow, okay. I totally survived that fall. That's pretty broken. Man, my character is a god. Alright, well, thanks for watching. We'll uh, do a horde night and have that as a separate video. Hope you enjoyed this masterpiece of the, of the building.